Well, let's have a little bit of fun. When I met Sarah in Lajitas, you know, for me, and I think it was pretty well covered, I was a goner from the very beginning. In our family, for 30 years, news that Andrew's coming has been a bugle call that means you tell him I'm coming and fun's coming with me. In February of 2016, after an Argyle dinner, I went home and I wrote, fate needs something to hit Andrew with. Four days later, fate found Sarah Bailey. When I got home from that magical weekend, I immediately realized that the cards were stacked heavily not in my favor. I tried to count how many airplane flights I've booked to see Sarah. I tried to calculate how many miles driven to see you. And I think it's a conservative 50,000 miles. The road was long and very well traveled. told me he wanted to marry uh, Sarah, and I said, great. But I loved it because you were so nervous. I mean, I was too, but, but you were nervous, and I, and I liked that. I do. <laughs> now, I'll admit, I gave you a man hug when we left, and that was a little awkward, but I, but, <laughs> but I was nervous too. We were both nervous, but bottom line, we were so happy for the both of y'all. Uh, we're happy for our family, and the extended Cardwell family, you know, we just ask that you have a happy marriage, that you're devoted to one another in love, that you honor each other above yourselves. May you have joy and hope, be patient in affliction, and faithful in prayer, always being led by God. And I think our prayer is that you two can love each other as much as Jesus loves you. an answered prayer for me. This has been a God thing for me. And I think that uh, we should just all raise our glasses and thank God because he gets the glory because tomorrow I get the girl. Cheers. Sarah, your love for Andrew was just a friendship, you told me. Just ordinary water. Maybe good pure water, good clean water, but ordinary. And tonight, it's wine. Tonight, it's rich. Tonight, it's extremely valuable. That's what Jesus does. He turned the water into wine. Andrew, you may kiss your bride, Sarah. I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Andrew Cardwell. I remember Sarah calling me and through tears, she said she cried when she and Andrew had to part ways. And that was just one of many times when tears would be shed when they had to say their Sunday goodbyes. Now there will be no more Sunday goodbyes. Sarah and Andrew both share a strong faith and are such a good balance for each other. God truly knew what he was doing when he put these two together.